And welcome back. It's Brian the Grizzly here with Brand Man Brandon. We're going to check out another trailer real quick. Yes, Brandon, we which are. One, which one do you want to do? Um, you know, I was thinking. Uh, so there's a story ab- about about a about a dude who um who starts dating a girl, and I guess her exes get angry about it. <laughs> I think so it's de- from your T-shirt. Let's go do Scott Pilgrim takes takes over. Mm-hmm. Takes off. So I'm gonna pull it up right now, and we can watch this to see how it looks. Let's do this. I am in. We are sex, I can hear it. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> the cast, though, they brought everyone back. November 17th. Mm-hmm. And Netflix has been doing it, man. Yep. You 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 don't have to tell me twice. I am so in. I am so can't can't you tell I'm excited? Exactly. <laughs> Look at your shirt. You knew we were doing it. You're like, I'm ready, guys. I'm ready. Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh man. Um what's your, first thought, it, though? what's your first thing when you seeing all this stuff? Well, you know, the um the the live action movie I think is like one of the most underrated comic book or graphic novel films ever made. Awesome. Um, I, yeah, I love that. This is like, they translated the, um, I'm not sure if you've read the graphic novels. I have all of them, but um, I'm not, I'm not sure. Um, but, but yeah, they, they literally brought the animation style um, to, to life on the, um, for this looks like it jumped off the pages. That's awesome. Um, I, I'm not like huge, huge, huge in the anime, but this is Scott Pilgrim, which I love. I've always loved Scott Pilgrim. So when I heard that they were making this, I was instantly interested. Uh, this this came together a lot quicker than I thought, man, because it seems like they just announced that they were making this just a couple of months ago, like earlier this year, that they were making it. So I was assuming it would be like a year, year and a half wait or something like that. Especially um, within the level of stars and the amount of stars and the level of stars that you need for this. And yeah, Kendrick, Mary is Elizabeth Winstead, Brie mm-hmm. Larson, Aubrey Brie Larson. Plaza, yeah, Chris Jason Evans, Sportsman, Chris Evans, Jason. Mike mm-hmm. Sarah. Like, dude, it, it goes on. Brandon Brand Routh. I was like, what the Brandon Brand. Routh? What the hell's like you saw Brandon Routh? Like, mm-hmm. with all these people coming in, I mean, that's a, a quick time, a quick turnaround. So, unless everyone's a, a fan and everyone mm-hmm. really loved doing it, that's the only way this can work, especially because now we're in this, 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 uh, this, this time where you know, the actors can't do anything with the strike, mm-hmm. the fact that we're getting this information and getting this 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 trailer means that they loved it and they were doing it right away and everyone was on board. Right. Yeah, they they must have been working on this longer than we thought. But mm-hmm. um, yeah, I'm 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 definitely watching this. I'm definitely gonna be there. May even have to take a little. Maybe may even have to take a day or two off work. <laughs> just just because this is going to have my undivided attention and I want nothing else on my mind. I mean, so episode one comes out with well, November 17th. Mm-hmm. It was right around Thanksgiving. You know, you'll yeah. be able to enjoy it and then have episode two with some turkey. You'll be all mm-hmm. right with that. I mean, this is interesting. And Netflix is going to, so Netflix, they don't do it week to week, right? They drop yeah. everything all at the same time. They drop the entire thing. Yeah. I'm, um, I'm I'm gonna see if I could get my dad to watch this because my dad does like the Scott Pilgrim movie. I showed it to him. My dad thinks the scene where uh where where Scott dives out the window is like one of the funniest things ever. <laughs> um, so yeah, yeah, I I I, I gotta I I I'm I'm not even interested in anything else that month. <laughs> not even Thanksgiving as much. Not even Doom. He's gonna not throw e- everything else out the window. <laughs> Oh yeah, this this trumps Doom. I'm definitely gonna see Doom, but 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 this is this is at the top of my list for the month of November. It's very very cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm, the animation I'm sorry. style was very mm-hmm. interesting though. I will say that um, 
It was so fast paced. It's going to hit you in the very, face, really. This anime is in- interesting. Yeah, very fast paced and vibrant. I love it. I ask you, what do you think the plot will be? You read the not the graphic novel. What do you think it will be? From the from the looks of it, it just seems like an ex, um, basically like an extended version of the plot from the um, from the graphic novel series. Scott just um, trying to date Ramona and defeat her seven evil exes. It seems like there's going to be like a little more fleshing out of the seven evil exes. You know, we saw like Lucas Lee, Chris Evans's character, doing more skateboarding. I think we mm-hmm. saw like a couple other things. Um, from other characters, so I think we're going to get more backstory for them. I think they're going to get the shine a little more. I think that the um, the live action movie did an incredible job of translating it to the screen. There there were some changes here and there, but for the most part, it was pretty much a um, it, it was a very faithful and dare I say almost spot on adaptation. But I think this will have the chance to to go deeper. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. I mean, I, I know that when, when it's a TV series and it's not one of those things. It's a series, so mm-hmm. you, you're not going to get all the entire story right away, and you're not going to follow the graphic novels exactly because you want to go on more than one season. So I, mm-hmm. I, I'm interested to see how they do that. Yeah. Do you think this is something that'll 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 go um, beyond just one season? I think releasing things in November is very. Uh, a smart idea, especially in this writer strike and things are not going to be coming out as as much. So really gets the spotlight. I think that's a, always a problem when you're releasing things in the summertime and, and early fall. It's because there's so many things happening at the same time. But when you do it, mm-hmm. it's the spotlight. And if, if you get a following, I could see three, four seasons of this. And I take it. And it's going to change some of the, you know, of the, the groundwork and it's going to go it's going to expand even more. Mm-hmm. Which is, I think, what you want. You want the story to see. You want to see where the story goes. We all know that the initial story, you know, the seven evil exes. We all know about that. But where does it mm-hmm. go from there? Where does yeah. Scott go from there? Mm-hmm. So, I mean, I think that's going to be interesting. Yeah, same. You know, there's. It seems like there's a lot that they could do with this. All right, and so, you, uh, you, are we going to keep all these stars doing this stuff? Oh man, I sure hope so. I hope they don't bring them bring them all back just for a one and done. I'd love to see this. Um, I'd, I'd love to see th- this go on with the same consistent cast. Um, and I think they will because if you've seen any of the behind the scenes stuff or content for the Scott Pilgrim movie for the original Scott Pilgrim movie, you, you could tell that they um, that they really just had a ton of fun doing this and. You know, even though a lot of them have blown up, you know, Michael Sarah's consistently worked. Chris Evans, obviously, has star. like a yeah, superstar Captain America. Oh, Brie Larson, you know, she's in the MCU, too. She's consistently Anna Kendrick. I was like, you Anna know, Kendrick always has a job. Always. Yeah, always. <laughs> so, but um, but Bobby they Plaza. seem like Aubrey Plaza, you know, White Lotus, stuff like that. But I think they've all... Um, as far as I could tell, obviously, I don't know any of these people personally, but they've always come off as pretty fun and pretty cool people. And they, you could tell they had a fun time working on the first movie. So this had to have been a fun, like a, like a fun opportunity just to come back and, and, and revisit the, these, these characters. I agree. And I cannot mm-hmm. wait for it to come out November 17th. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean, this is just really interesting, really cool. I hope it gets a good, good following. I hope it's the right time great good timing for this stuff and uh, mm-hmm. I'd be interested how they're going to release these episodes because as of right now everything's only on that one episode but we know Netflix doesn't go week by week mm-hmm. so I don't know how they're going to release everything but I, I can't wait to see yeah hmm? alright you got anything else for this one I think that's about it I am very excited for this this jumped like very high up on my list for this fall all right, guys, start getting your calendars together. Figure out mm-hmm. what you're going to do. This needs to be on your list. November 17th, we're getting the first episode. Hopefully, we get a whole thing uh, for everything, for a whole uh, calendar for everything. We know exactly when it's going to come out. Uh, man, Netflix, they, they're doing it. They're doing big things and doing good production. They're putting money, their money where their mouth is. So they are. I'm hoping that this is like going to be a great, another great one, a banger for that they're releasing. So. Mm-hmm. Uh, 
I want to know what you guys are thinking about this thing. Do you are you excited by seeing Scott Pilgrim? Are you are you going to compare it to the live action? What is your thought process and what what are you excited about? Are you excited about all these characters coming back? Are we going to hit it back? Is it going to follow the graphic novel? Mm-hmm. Let me know what we what we what you're thinking. Come in the comments. Let us know. I'm sure Brandon will be right there trying to figure out and answer those questions for you. Um, this is all we got today, guys. So this is our trailer reaction, and we will be back with you guys a little bit later. For now, we'll see you later. Thanks, guys.